the problem is now they look, you know, they look about the same as they did Tuesday morning and Monday morning. So we, we've had this this which week is already, which was, yeah, it was, it was tough. But these numbers are still dropping, and I think they're going to oh. keep dropping through like 8 o'clock, even 9 o'clock this morning after the sun's up. Wow. It's just going to be really cold. So, you know, if you, if you work outside in the elements especially, just make sure you are layered up. You have the hand warmers and, and feet warmers, whatever you need. It is going to be just a really, really cold day, a, a cold morning for sure. 11 degrees right now, but it feels about minus 4. The winds out of the north around 13 miles per hour. We'll occasionally get some gusts that are going to be over 15 miles per hour today. So I've got the winds right around 10 to 20. And right now it feels four below zero in Detroit, eight below though in Pontiac, four below in Howell, and about five below in Mount Clemens, three below zero in Port Huron. Those are wind chills. The temperature is still around 10 or 11 degrees in Detroit, but dropping to about seven or eight degrees in Livingston County and Lapeer County. So uh, really cold, dangerously cold. You can get frostbite to expose skin in as little as 30 minutes. So again, and just make sure you don't forget hat and, and gloves today. And especially if you're just thinking, well, I'm just running from the parking lot to the building, whatever you're doing, just make sure you, you have it with you uh, just in case. It's going to be that kind of a cold day for us. So wind chills right now minus 4. This afternoon, we're only going to rise to about 12 or 13 degrees, and the wind chills are going to stay below zero throughout the day. We're also going to see occasionally some flurries. So a mix of sun and clouds. At times, it's going to be bright. Other times, clouds are going to fill in. It'll be one of those days, so grab your sunglasses too, but also know that there will be a few snowflakes, maybe a few flurries. Shouldn't be a big deal as far as travel is concerned. Temperatures, uh, single digits this morning, rising only to about 13 degrees this afternoon. Tonight's interesting. A low is going to be around 4 or 5 degrees, but it's going to drop quickly. The temperatures drop quickly after the sun goes down, and it's going to be really cold, and even only maybe 7 or 8 degrees by 8 o'clock tonight. But temperatures will start to rise after about 2 in the morning, and we may be closer to about 10 or 11 degrees by the time the sun comes up tomorrow morning. So temperatures starting to rise before sunrise. And then tomorrow afternoon gets breezy, but milder air is moving in. High of 30 degrees tomorrow. And we stay around 30 degrees Saturday night into Sunday morning. And Sunday, we're up close to 40 degrees. Chance of a light mix Sunday afternoon. And uh, might see a few snowflakes that just melt on contacts. It's well above freezing. 37 the high Monday, and then we really warm up. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, going to melt a lot of the snow. Temperatures topping out in the roughly mid-40s. Does come with a chance of rain showers Tuesday and then more widespread rain Thursday.